Hey friends, welcome back to Kimmy's Kitchen and more. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm still not like 100%, so you can probably get hear it in my voice and probably can see it on my face, but I wanted to do a couple of videos because I'm way behind on videos. I did finally catch up on comments, um, but I'm way behind actually on watching all my friends too. I've, I have been watching videos, but I still got a lot more to feed through um, to watch. So yeah. Um, so today is Tuesday, so that means it's Tea Tuesday. <coughs> and the, um, excuse me, the tea that I'm having today is not actually tea. It is the, it's their, I guess, early fall, you'd call it milkshake. And it's the, I think it's called like butterscotch crumble. Compliments of my son, he blessed me with this. So thank you, Dominic. Um, he actually bought, I guess, late lunch, early dinner for my daughter and himself. And he asked, you know, whatever I wanted, but I didn't actually, um, want anything because I'm kind of just eating like, um, one meal a day, trying to get back into building it up because I was just like not eating nothing and then I was eating, um, chicken noodle soup and then I just slowly started, um, building up and actually when I had went to the doctor last Tuesday, he said, you know, just stay away from anything, um, heavy and greasy. So that's what I've been trying to do too. But I have some friend mail here that I wanted to share with you guys. And um, it was a complete surprise. So it is from my wonderful friend Kim over at Kim's Inspired Life. And it's so funny because I had sent her out a package last week and then she went on vacation. So I know when she gets back, it's going to be there for her, but it, she won't get it. Um, but I had sent it be prior prior to getting sick. So, um, but I actually just realized I need scissors. So hold on one second. Okay, I'm back. So yes, I have... Um, Oh, it says boo mail. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited because I have seen other people um, receive boo mail. I've never received boo mail. And um, I just recently saw someone receive boo mail from Kim. Oh my gosh, I can't even think right now who it was. Um, but it was super cute stuff, of course. Um, I think it was Lucia at Tea Who Creates, I think. Um, but I also received um, friend mail from my sweet friend Kathy over at Cat Cast and Cali. I'm so sorry that I did not get to join in in our so, um, ATC and DC. I didn't get to join in any collabs last week. Last Monday to Tuesday, What's Up Wednesday, um, my new to me, um, our, mine and Tony and Kat's ATC and DC. I had already pre-recorded that Sunday video that went out, and that's the day, that's the morning I woke up sick. Um, so I had that video for that day, and then I had also had already pre-recorded two days before that on that Friday, my Friday hauls for the following week. Um, so I was able to participate in those two, but that was it. Um, so I got lots of catching up to do, um, so that'll be fun. But let me get started here on this. Ruby's looking out the window, and she sees my husband out there, and so she's barking. <clears throat> but yeah, I think I was starting to say, and I got sidetracked. Um, I had went to the doctor on Tuesday. I had taken my daughter the Friday before, and they said a viral infection, and then I went, I was starting feeling horrible, and Sunday was in bed all day Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and finally I was like, kind of nervous because um, I've had bronchitis one time my whole life. I didn't think it was bronchitis, um, but my ribs were hurting. And so I was kind of concerned, like I've been laying around a lot, you know, um, is it just from coughing or could it be pneumonia? So I was like, I better go. So I went to the doctor on Tuesday and um, 
Oh, excuse her. Um, they um, said it was a viral infection, but there is a lot of RSV going around. So I don't know if RSV was the one. It would make a lot of sense because I've been very short of breath when I walk upstairs. And they tested me um, for the C. No C, thankfully. They tested me for um, pneumonia and for um, strep. And I didn't have any of that, which I didn't think I had strep because my throat was feeling better by Tuesday. Um, nothing else was, just my throat. Um, oh my goodness, Kim. Oh my goodness. <laughs> You're awesome, Kim. Okay. I was looking to see if there's a card. Is there a card in here? I'm not sure. No, there, I don't see a card. But look at this beautiful, beautiful bag that Kim put together. Like, honestly, guys, I don't know how Kim does it. She's my hero. <laughs> She's my hero. Kim is the busiest woman. I always just think, like, I was so busy. And Miss Brenda, I always think that uh, us two are just, like, neck and neck with how many things we have to do. But let me tell you what. Kim, ooh, your friend is on the go. Um, you know, she's still teaching. She's so involved in the church. She is so involved with her grandchildren and her children and, you know, um, her um, the, her husband's the spouses, you know, her daughter-in-laws and everything. It's just like, and then her, own, her and her husband going on vacation together. I mean, she has so many things going on. And she sits down and crafts and sends out free mail and boo mail to people like, when are you doing it? I'm like, are you doing it on the airplane? <laughs> like, when do you have time? <laughs> are you going down through, like, are you going to LA sometimes? And, you're, and I know what that tra that traffic's like in LA, okay? Because I've been to California a couple times. And are you like on the 101 and you're like, okay, time to craft. <laughs> Got to wait three hours. <laughs> I don't know, but she's amazing. So let me share with you a boo mail. First off, look at this gorgeous cellophane bag and this I know Kim made this it's gorgeous and I'll definitely be reusing that she put these fun little um, beads in here and I actually just got back into y'all know I make my jewelry my necklaces and my earrings but I just got back into um, starting to make bracelets so you'll see some friend mail out there where I've sent to people so um, I'm not gonna say who because she hasn't gotten it yet but um, I just had mailed it couple days ago so but look she put those in there they're so fun and then she put this <laughs> this is so fun look at that pen oh my gosh it's like a little skeleton hand and it's a pen and the skeleton is holding it I absolutely love it it is so fun it is so cute and has the 31 for October 31st Kim you are just so fun and creative I just oh, I would love to be in that brain and just use some of that talent of creativity she's amazing so thank you that is beautiful i will definitely it's adorable i will definitely be using that and then oh she got me some fun die cuts you know how all the die cuts that i've recently um you know purchased or people have purchased for me i don't have any numbers so this is fun because you can put you could do like um birthday numbers and put them on there so that's really fun and then this one Let's see. I'm not going to be able to tell what it says. I don't think it says it on the bag. Um, hmm. I don't know. Y'all y'all tell me if you can figure it out. I'll figure it out as soon as we're done. <coughs> Excuse me. I'll figure it out as soon as we're done. And then she put this fun string and tag in here with this cute little pumpkin, little jack-o'-lantern. How cute is that? <laughs> Oh my gosh, and look at these fun little um, papers I can create with and make little ATCs, so I'll be doing that. I'm sure you'll see that on this week's um, ATC MDCs, so I can try to get those mailed out. Look, how fun. Thank you, Kim. And these are beautiful. I love those. Oh my gosh, fun, 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 fun. And then, oh, look at this cute little bracelet keychain. How fun and adorable is that? Y'all know I love my keychains. I've told y'all before, I am gonna think of a creative way to hang my keychains. 
for display um because y'all just you won't believe it like how many keychains i have and it's all because y'all have blessed me with them like i was trying to think if i've actually even purchased very many on my own um so yeah it says because happy happens when you choose it absolutely absolutely love that kim super super cute love that and she gave me some yummy Reese's White Ghosts. There's four in here. And I'll be putting those in the refrigerator and eating those when I have all my strength and energy back up and I get into back into my um, sweet tooth mode. I'll definitely be eating those. So thank you, Kim. And then look at this. How cute are these? They're mini mouse little chapsticks. And I actually... I have a keychain that is a, um, it holds your chapstick. I got it at Walmart like, I don't know, probably a year ago. And um, I need to actually refill it. So I'll be putting that in there. Super cute. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Love it. Love it. Love you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then, oh, one of those beads. Look at that. I thought I felt something in my slipper. One of those beads fell in there. That's funny. Fun, fun, fun. So yeah. And then let me open up. Thank you so much, Kim. And you guys go over and check her out. You won't be a bit disappointed in her channel, I'm telling you. She's a lot of fun. She's just she's she has a lot of fun energy. She's just fun. I just oh my gosh. I adore Kim. More than she knows. And this is for my sweet friend Kat. And I've enjoyed getting to know Kat so much. And her name is Kathy, and it's Cat Cast and Callie. And not only had last week, I had oh, ooh, she put me some goodies in here. Oh my goodness, y'all are blessing me with some some sweet tooth items. That's awesome. Not only had us sent out, I guess, a, what probably about two weeks now, um, for the mail to Kim. Oh, but I had also sent out to um, just in the last few days to Kat um, because I wanted to thank her for my um, birthday goodies. And so I had sent stuff out to her. And so that's so funny, she sent me, so I guess maybe some boo mail. I'll find out here in a second. Um, but I'm gonna put my readers on and see if I can figure out what this says. Oh, it says he is risen. Yes, he is risen, amen. Thank you, Kim. I love that. I love that die. I really don't have many Easter ones, so I love it. Love it, love it, love it. And then, <clears throat> let's see. Oh, oh my goodness. I, I believe I did get booed because look, I believe this is a boo bag. <coughs> First off, I gotta show y'all. Oh, wait a minute. She put a paper in here for me. Hi, Kimmy. Sending you a little surprise, a little surprise mail, Kathy. Aww. <laughs> Thank you, Kathy. That's so sweet. I'm going to put your stuff on there so I'll get it confused with Kim's. And then she put me some fun candy in here. So there is a, a Werther's original. And there's some more Werther's. And these are the coffee. And you know what? Thank you for sending these because I have never had the coffee flavor. So thank you. So now I can give that a try. And then look what she put in here. I just I love these cat. This is awesome. Um, look at all these, these already cut out. I can just go ahead and start creating on them. Wow. And it's like she made this one with, a, um, with cardboard. That is awesome. I never even thought to do that. I feel like someone told me that you could use it, um, you can even use like um, cereal boxes or anything. And I just, y'all know I love to recycle, so that's like such a fabulous idea. But thank you so much. So I'm gonna be getting busy um, creating with the MDCs and the the blessings from Kim the, the, um, to make the ATCs. And look, she put this cute little pin in here. It's a little maple leaf, isn't that beautiful? And then she put in a, oh, it says a folding bag hook. How neat. And look, it is cheetah print. Oh, I see. Okay, so it holds right onto your, oh, cool. It holds like right onto your desk. 
cheetah print too. Love that. And then it just holds your like your purse or whatever you need to hold on your desk. So love that. Thank you, Kat. Very cool. Very cool. And then she did, I'm gonna pull everything out so I can show you this gorgeous bag. She put everything in this bag. Look how beautiful. And that's the front and the back. It's got little ghosties on it. How cute is that? And then look at that. I love it. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I, I feel like I've been so brain fogged since I got sick that I'm just like, uh, not thinking clearly. I don't even think I said Tea Tuesday is hosted by Kathy over at, Kat, at, over at Kathy's Favorite Things and Patty over at Life of Patty. And they are wonderful, awesome ladies too with wonderful, awesome channels. And of course, I'll link their channel down below too. So please go over and check out Kathy at Kathy's Favorite Things, Patty at Life with Patty, and Kim over at Kim's Inspired Life, and Kat over at Kat Cast and Kelly, and I'll link all their channels down below. Okay, with that being said, let me get back to it. So, she put in there these adorable cutouts of like leaves and these fun little sticks for like cupcakes. Oh my gosh, how fun, how fun, how fun. Let me tell you what, my kids are going and my kids future spouses are going to just, I'm going to drive them crazy with um, <laughs> making cakes and cupcakes and stuff for, uh, and donuts and stuff like that for my future grandchildren someday because, and I know that's quite a while off, but um, well not, not quite a while for the one for my son, maybe, but, <laughs> but look, they, um, these are be so fun to put on cupcakes. And then there's a little, um, dandelion. Is that a dandelion? I think a sunflower, a sunflower. See what I mean? I'm just like so fog brained. It's crazy. It's so fog brained. And then a cute little leaf. And I love these. These are so cute, Cass. Thank you. And then she put all these fun little, little fun pumpkins. I could glue down to ATCs and MDCs. Love them. So cute. So thoughtful. So sweet. And then all of these. So fun. And there's another one. And then this big one. Love it. And then, um, oh, how fun. Look, I have a friend who just loves deers and things and I can make her a card that says follow la la la. Ah, I've got lots of friends who love gnomies. Oh, how fun. You know, Christmas will be here before you know it, guys. Little snowflakes. Oh, how sweet. It says Merry Christmas. I'll definitely be crafting with all these. And this one says Merry Christmas. And then this one says, have yourself a merry little Christmas. And then this one says Noel. Noel. I always thought that was a pretty name too. And those are like little, um, little acorns, which my, my Max always loved to eat them and steal them from the squirrels, but Ruby doesn't. And then peace and joy. It's funny the things that he ate and he liked that she wouldn't dare touch. Like he loved, um, uh, squash and cucumbers and bananas and she's just like uh no I don't think so <laughs> I don't want that but <clears throat> I always said he was a human garbage king because he would eat anything he was silly so silly and then look she put these beautiful <laughs> she knows me well she put these beautiful rhinestones in there it's a multi-pack aren't they gorgeous they're so pretty I saw a car one day, I got out, my husband and I were getting out one day to go into a store, and um, in this car beside of us, it had rhinestones, she had a rhinestone on her door handles, around her steering wheel, like in her inside, you could see it, because you know, when you're walking by, you can see it, and I mean, they were, they, it was very, I know it might sound cheesy, but it was really classy the way she had it, it was all just the diamond rhinestones, and it, um, whoever did it did a really good job, 
and I was like, oh, isn't that pretty? I was like, everything's so sparkly. And my husband's like, don't even think about it. He goes, is enough with that cheetah print steering wheel cover? He's like, no, you would not have that. <laughs> so whatever, if I wanted to have it. <laughs> but it looked like a lot of work. Somebody probably did it for her professionally. But, um, and then she put these, look how gorgeous. I can't wait to craft with these. She knows me and my bling, and I love my bling everywhere. Oh, by the way, this is Max, for those of you who are new and don't know. That's my Maxi. And then he's also over here, right there in that picture with me. Yeah, that's my Maxi. He's not with us anymore, but he'll always be with me. Well, Cam, thank you so, so much for my beautiful boo bag, my boo mail. And thank you so much, Kat, for my beautiful friend mail. And I think I got booed, too. So thank you both so much. And thank you, Kathy and Patty, for hosting this wonderful collab. And I hope everyone goes over and checks out everyone that I just talked about. And I hope you guys have a wonderful um, rest of your day and week. And stay safe, be blessed, and until next time. Bye, y'all.